Hello everyone, I am Dr. Prem Kumar, Consultant Diabetic Foot and Podiatric Surgeons at Apollo Hospital Greens Road. Today we are going to discuss about uh, diabetic foot infection management. So, diabetic uh, foot infection when the patient usually steps in, they will have uh, certain common things. They will be having an ulcer, there will be a discharge from the wound site, foul smelling uh, pus, swelling of the limb, discoloration of the surrounding skin, plus or minus the patient may be having a fever. So, if these symptoms are there, then we can label it as a diabetic foot infection for a diabetic patient. Usually at Apollo, we have a holistic uh, team approach when it comes for diabetic foot management. So, who are all the doctors and the team involved in diabetic foot management? So, usually we diabetic foot and podiatric surgeon, we do a cleaning work that is we remove the infection surgically and there is a, a specialized anesthetic team who are uh, specialized in giving a regional nerve block rather uh, we do not generally prefer a general anesthesia. And then uh, we have a diabetologist who controls the blood sugar of the patient so that uh, infection control and healing will be better. We have an infectious disease consultant who uh, suggests us uh, to give a, a preferred antibiotic in a correct dosage and as per guidelines. We have a dietitian as well as physiotherapy support. So, we all with all these things we give holistic care at Apollo Hospitals Greens Road. And when it comes for uh, uh, diabetic foot management, we uh, as a surgeon, we clean the wound and followed by we have a dedicated nurse who are uh, doing uh, dressings with the, uh, for the patient and then uh, followed by we usually close the wound uh, by giving ideal uh, skin cover and uh, we suggest the patient appropriate footwear. We usually suggest microcellular polymer footwear, we uh, commonly say as a MCP footwear and then uh, uh, once the uh, treatment part is over, so we usually tell the patient to come for follow up. Like that, we follow a holistic uh, team approach at Apollo Hospitals Greens Road. And then uh, uh, when it comes for prevention, we always suggest the patient to come for routine follow up and uh, use moisturizer liberally so that the skin integrity is maintained. You, uh, we uh, advise the patient to use uh, footwear every time indoor as well as outdoor. What I earlier said is uh, microcellular polymer it, uh, footwear. It is uh, appropriate to use cotton socks along with footwear. Three mantras for diabetic foot prevention is wearing a diabetic footwear which is a medical grade microcellular polymer footwear, using a cotton socks and using a moisturizer and routine doctor's visit. If the diabetic, if any diabetic patient follows this four advice, definitely they can 80 to 90 percent, they can prevent the upcoming future infection as well as they can prevent the amputation rate. Usually, um, overall the worldwide, the amputation is very, very common. Diabetic foot am amputation is uh, unfortunately one of the preventable amputation uh, which we are doing. So, uh, when it comes for trauma, all these things, it is not preventable. Diabetic foot amputation is a preventable amputation. If they follow these four advice, definitely amputation can be prevented so that uh, their life will be happy. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye. Thank you.